Hi there, welcome back. Now let's go through a pretty challenging question on rates. Ali and Ben worked together, took 5 days to paint a house. If Ali and Ben worked together for 2 days, followed by Ali working alone for 9 days, Ben will take one more day to complete the remaining work. And the question asks, how long will Ali take to paint a house all by himself? Alright, this is a pretty challenging question on rates. Okay, so I've really given you my warning. Okay, but however, I would still like you to try this question first without uh, looking at the solutions. Okay, so uh, do pause the video now and give this question a go. Alright, welcome back. I hope they have put some sufficient thoughts into it. Okay, so now let's look at the first sentence first. Ali and Ben together took 5 days to paint their house. So can you tell me in one day, how much of the house would they paint? The answer is 1 out of 5. Okay, and that's the, re the reason is because if 5 days take to paint one house, in one day they can only complete 1 out of 5 of the house. Understand? And this will be the total rates for Ali and Ben. You can recall why it's rate, right? Rate means how fast they do their work. Alright, so the rate for Ali plus the rate for Ben will be equal to 1 out of 5 house per day. Okay, so after 2 days, can you tell me how much of the house would they have painted? The answer is simply just 2 fifth. Right, because 2 times 1 fifth, you get 2 fifth. And so if they have completed 2 fifth of the house, what is the leftover? Okay, the remaining house will be 1 minus 2 out of 5, you get 3 out of 5. So far, so good. Alright, so we know that after 2 days, they have completed 2 fifth of the house, and now they need to complete 3 fifth of the house. Okay, and how do they complete this leftover? Ali worked for 9 days, while Ben worked for 1 day. Alright, and we know that Ali read in 1 day is A. So can you tell me in 9 days, how much of the house will Ali complete? The answer is simply just 9A. Right, in this case, the A is algebra. It stands for unknown fraction because we do not know the rate for Ali. Okay, so we simply let... Uh, Ali rate be A, so in 9 days, the house completed by Ali will be equal to 9A. Understand? Okay, and in 1 day, similarly, to find Ben, you simply take 1 out of 5 minus away A to get B. Alright, so in 1 day, the house completed by Ben will be 1 out of 5 minus A. Okay, and now we know that together, Alright, they will complete the leftover, which is 3 out of 5. So we can form an equation. Alright, and what's the equation? It will be 9a, which is the house completed by Ali in the 9 days, plus 1 out of 5 minus a, which is the house completed by Ben in the 1 day. And we'll take this add, add together. You'll get a leftover, which is 3 out of 5. Understand? Alright, so from here, let's solve the equation. When you take 9a minus a, you get 8a. And when you bring over the 1 out of 5, you get 3 out of 5 minus 1 out of 5, you get 2 out of 5. So to find a, you take 2 out of 5 divided by 8, you get 1 over 20. Wow, fantastic. Okay, we have finally calculated the rate for a. So what does this 1 over 20 mean? It means that in one day, Ali by himself can complete 1 out of 20 of the house. Okay, so based on this information, can you tell me how many days does Ali take to paint the house by himself? The answer will be 20 days. Alright, so the reason is once again, in one day, Ali paint 1 out of 20 of the house. So to complete the whole house, you, you will need 20 days. Okay, and a shortcut that I teach my students is, alright, when I given the rate, to find the time, you simply reverse the rate. And when I say reverse, means you take the denominator, divide by the numerator, and you get a number of days. Do you manage to get this one correct? If you didn't get correct, don't get demoralized, right? Because I've already warned you that this is a pretty challenging question. So I hope that after watching this video, you are able to understand how, the, how to solve this question, and you'll be able to uh, solve a similar type of questions in your exams.